The lighthouse is shining onto the Pack-a-Punch. What is wrong with you, Joe? Um, I mean, uh, hmm, Pack-a-Punch or Pack-a-Poncho, am I right, Donnie? Oh, nice, exactly what I needed. You don't have any perks. You're not making it to round 20. You're not gonna win. Joe, I've watched you buy an Olympia to kill round one zombies. Don't even try come at me. Hell yeah, Olympia gang for the win. Hey everyone, it's your boy, The Big D, and today Joe has challenged me to a no-perk challenge on Call of the Dead. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna last at all. Call of the Dead is a really hard map, and without perks, you'll be lucky if you even get to round 10. Mm, sure, whatever, Joe. Could you inform the people watching at home what the ground rules are for this challenge? Sure, Donnie. You're not allowed to buy any perks. That's pretty much all there is to the challenge. Huh? Joe, you are so incredibly stupid. What about the pack of punch? Can I use that? Of course, it isn't a perk. And the only rule you have is that I can't buy a perk? Yes. I'm smashing your challenge. What round do I have to get to? Let's say round 20. Jesus, Joe, I mean, sure, I'll smash it. Hell yeah, first two rounds have been a breeze. This challenge will be so easy, Joe. I mean, sure, but you're telling me the double-digit rounds without Jug will be easy? Come on, Trump, even I call your bluff there. Oh yeah, just watch and see how a pro does it, Joe. I'm very interested to see how this pro thinks he's gonna tackle round three with no ammo. I was getting ammo. Just waiting for the zombies to spawn, that's all. Whatever, man, you just wasn't checking your ammo. Take that zombie bag. Oh, get him, Donnie. You see that skill there, Joe? Oh, huh, what? I was checking my Discord. Whatever. Time to get to the mystery box. Let's hope you get a ray gun and down yourself from splash damage. Wait, what? You're an absolute fool. The box is on top of the lighthouse. No, no. I was looking for the pack of punch, Joe. You're the fool. Sure you was. You haven't even turned the power on. Not to mention you literally said you was heading for the mystery box. Well, it looks like I need more points to get to the top. Guess we wait for the zombies. Finally, some meatheads. One down. K to the I to the A, zombie. Yeah, get stabbed, zombie. What? No Joe that doesn't count? That was a warm-up, Joe. Ah, <laughs> damn, Trump, you're really bad at this game, aren't you? It was a practice. Besides, I got a good box spawn now. You're excited over the mystery box, but anyone with skill could beat this challenge without RNG. <laughs> Jesus, Trump, you can't even stab properly. Even George is laughing at how bad you are. Joe, I've watched you buy an Olympia to kill round one zombies. Don't even try come at me. Hell yeah! Olympia gang for the win! Damn it, Joe. Maybe don't high road the Olympia down my frickin' ear hole, Joe. Oopsie, he's sorry, Trump. All right, mystery box time. Oh, that's better. We can finally uh, see that. I don't even remember what this gun is called, but I know it's trash. Like it Let's hope you get bad luck all game, so you might learn to play the game with skill. Don't talk about skill. I will smash you at diner turned any day. Yeah, except we played that already, and who won again? I forgot. Um. Oh, I remember it was me. You suck, Trump. Admit it. My ammo situation is less than ideal. So you can't even deny it. You're too taken aback by how I went beast mode and smashed you and Obama. Time to go beast mode. Um, what? Whoa, you just got destroyed, Donald. Now let's see who the sleepy one really is. How is Biden playing like a god all of a sudden? Get good, Trump. Surprise. I swear your new name will be Sneaky Joe. Obama, we really have to do something. Get wrecked, noobs! Kaboom! Oh my god. I swear to god, we just lost to Sleepy Joe. Damn right you did. After you called me a noob, Sleepy and the rest. Good times. Sure, well, whilst you was dreaming of the past, I managed to pull some good weapons from the box. The AUG is good, I guess. No, Joe, I don't think you understand. The AUG is perfect. It has a special ability when upgraded, which will allow me to easily beat your challenge. What is it? Aha, uh -huh, you'll see later, Joe. I just don't think you realize what map we're playing. I still wouldn't call this to fight. 
fight barehanded. So for my plan to work, I need the power on. One, because I need the pack-a-punch, and two, because I need the death machine drop to be able to spawn, which can only spawn in after I drink quick revive or turn on the power. But I need to be quick because I don't want to get trapped on this boat. Nice job, Donnie. Thank you, Joe. It's nice to hear you supporting me for once rather than trying to rip into me every second. I'm not supporting you. I'm saying nice job because if I remember correctly, George will now command the zombies to sprint at you. You're so screwed. Don't undermine the ace up my sleeve. Oh, nice. Exactly what I needed. Say hello to my little friend. Ah, I ate lead. Two hours later. Nice. It didn't kill him, but it's okay. So what's your plan now, Trump? I guess I just get enough to upgrade this gun and go upgrade. I'm gonna buy the sickle. Should help a lot with gaining points. Then all you need is a hammer, and you could join Putin's clan. Wow, Joe, another one of your classic Trump likes everything Russia jokes, just as original as the last one. Yeah, but that one was clever because of the hammer and sickle. Here's one for you, Joe. I'm sickle of your terrible jokes. Uh, I don't get it. You're so unbelievably stupid. Sickle time. I'm only defending myself. You. Okay, there's a lot of zombies. Yeah, kill him, boys. Rip him to pieces. Wow, thanks for the great support there, Joe. You make it so obvious that you want me to win. You don't have any perks. You're not making it to round 20. You're not going to win. You're right. Without Jug, I'm going to struggle. But let me remind you that your exact rule for this challenge was that I couldn't buy a perk. I can't purchase a perk, but maybe I can get Jug another way. What glitch trick are you going to pull out of your sleeve? Oh, Joe, you have no idea. Well, you're going to move that fast. This is getting intense. Joe, I know you don't want me to win in everything, but please, I've beaten round 20 on Bus Depot Survival. I know a thing or two about training zombies. Just think, though, all it takes is a double swipe and that's it. Or even better, all it takes is for you to get trapped one time. Yeah, but look at my points, Joe. I won't be getting trapped if I have an upgraded weapon. Yeah, but you still have to go find that thing. What do you mean, Joe? Well, the pack-a-punch disappears and you have to go find it before it sinks under the water. I always struggle to find it. Sometimes I wish they added a feature that would help you find the pack a punch, like maybe a tracker dog that can go and sniff for it. Joe, you absolute fool. I don't know about dogs and sniffing, but you've been sniffing some strong stuff to be that much of an idiot to not notice the lighthouse. You're gonna move that fast. Look, Joe, you can even see it in the distance. The lighthouse is shining onto the pack a punch. What is wrong with you, Joe? Um, I mean, uh, hmm, pack a punch or pack a poncho, am I right, Donnie? Wait, this is why you allowed the pack-a-punch into the challenge. You thought it was so hard to find that I'd get killed looking for it? Yeah, well, it looks like you won't need to look for it. Nope, I'm heading for it right now. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. Don't even speak to me, Joe. Hey, at least you got a carpenter. You're gonna suffer with me, Joe. You're gonna have to sit and watch me waiting for the pack-a-punch. With more, real secure. You know, what if we set up a business called Pack-a-Poncho? We could make and sell ponchos inspired by Call of Duty zombies. We could have some that look like the characters. Maybe even an El Burro themed one for the mule kick perk. Joe, I really don't care. It's a stupid idea, and we both know the name carries the whole thing. Hmm. 
How about one called Elemental Shop? We could have a shop themed after- Seven hours later. How about Mule Kickers? We could make shoes that look like Mule Kickers. Finally, the Pack-a-Punch. Mule Kickers, I'll write that one down. Let's upgrade the AUG. Don't disappear on me this time. It disappeared, just like Fourth Wife. Okay, Ultimus Nikolai. Hell yeah, the AUG sum. What now? Now it's time to unleash my fury. Rah! Die! No, my poor George. Scream and roar all you like, but you can't beat the AUG sum. Look at him, he doesn't even know what's going on. Oh shoot, I didn't mean to kill that zombie. That's what you get for hurting my George. Now try suffer through another round. That'll be easy with the upgraded AUG. I made a crawler and now George is going down. No, George! George is nearly down. You're horrible, Trump. Yay, finally! Give me my rewards! I can't believe it. What reward could you possibly receive from killing my beloved George? Ta-da! Donald, are you serious? No freaking way! You got Juggernog. Out of all the perks, you got Jug. Hello everyone, it's Obama. I am now reading to you a message from Spoon. I appreciate your patience with this video. I've had a lot of fans asking for my return, and I'm so grateful to see many people even asking if I'm okay. Yes, I'm okay for now. Life has thrown some hurdles, but I'm tackling things day by day. I also encountered some problems with the videos I wanted to make. Some may have noticed that I posted about making a long video with some friends, but unfortunately that footage never got to me due to some issue with our recording setup. But I would like to try that kind of content in the future. I've had to split this video into two parts for the sole intention of not making what could be a half hour video. So part two should be out soon. I've also had some exciting video ideas since the last video, so hopefully I will be getting started with them later. Some of you may also wonder how the side project is progressing. It's doing amazing and I'm hoping to publish more about it soon. I may post some of it using the community post feature. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Spoon. Well that was a touching message. Maybe my oddly robotic sounding voice didn't quite pick up on some of the tones of the message, but I'll let you in on a secret. Spoon doesn't pay us to read these for him, so it'll do. Anyway, I'm going. I'm busy with a little secret something, but you guys will learn about it soon. Thanks for watching this video. Obama out.